Martin, a hard fought away win this uh, this evening. What are your thoughts on the game? Uh, I thought they were, they were very good. Uh, I thought they competed really well. I just spoke to their manager and I thought everywhere apart from the final third on the pitch, they, they were equally, if not better than us, throughout different phases of the game. Um, but we've shown tremendous character tonight. Um, we've stuck at it. We've been resilient. Uh, we haven't played at our best, but again, you have to give credit to them because they pressed really well and put us under pressure early on. Um, and we've stuck to our guns um, and we've kept going. And we've scored a good goal again from another set piece through Nathan. And we've got one at the desk uh, with Sim from, from a good move, really, when we broke up the attack through Ezzy. Uh, and we broke well, and, and Sim's finished brilliantly. So, yeah, it's been a tough game, and that's a really good three points for us tonight. I mean, the first goal, you've got to look at Macaulay Manning on the corner again. We saw it on Saturday, and we've seen it again tonight. How, how vital has that been? Do you know, the quality um, that he delivers is absolutely excellent. As you said, we've seen it two or three times on Saturday. We scored from two of them. Um, we've seen it again tonight with the goal that we scored tonight as well, Matt. Um, but his delivery is great, and the thing is, the lads know where he's going to put it. So they can make those runs and, and, and know, knowing full well that it's going to be there or thereabouts. So, yeah, he's, 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 he's been great for us with regards to that. And at the end, Simo obviously pushing down the right hand side, managed to get his goal as well. Took it well. He took it really well. Uh, really pleased him. Obviously, he's had a, an issue with his toe. Um, it's been playing up for a couple of weeks. You know, we give him a few minutes on Saturday. We knew uh, legs would be tired today following Saturday's game, and he's gone on for a, half an hour or so. And again, done really well. Um, so, yeah, it's brilliant, brilliant to have him back. And, fit and raring to go and scoring goals like he scored tonight. I know it's absolutely freezing tonight, but there was quite a heated battle in midfield, especially in the first half. It, during half time, to get the team to come back out, do exactly what they did again, obviously grab the two goals, what were the words said? Well, we, 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 we talked about uh, our movement in midfield and, and looking at, at different options and making angles for the, for the person on the ball. I mean, one of the things that we recognised and talked about in there was the fact that there wasn't enough options. When the person's got the ball, there weren't enough people who wanted it and they were in great positions or either bodies in the way or they were you know, running away from the ball rather than coming towards it. Uh, and we couldn't get that fluidity and that momentum that we had on Saturday into our passing game. So, you know, we, we had to make those like fine adjustments and just try and get people in and around different areas so they could pick the ball up in a, in a, in a different area but in a more forward position rather than keep going square and backwards. I suppose Saturday was a tough game. Tonight, even tougher. Going into Saturday, it's it's not going to get any easier, is it? No, um, definitely not, because obviously we've now got 12 games left um, and, and every game's tough. And every game's tough, it really is. And obviously, we've, I don't know, we've got 12 unbeaten now as well and we want to keep that run going. Obviously, we were at home on Saturday again. Uh, crowd last week at home, fantastic. Numbers here tonight, you know, when we've come out, the noise that we're making, you just thought it was a home game again tonight. So, yeah, it, it's, it's a tough game, but, that, you know, no matter where you are in the league, they're all, they're all tough games and anybody can beat anybody on the day. And we just have to be at our best again. You mentioned the fans just, they were in fine voice this evening as they were on Saturday again and throughout the season, let's be honest. And how much of an importance to the team and yourselves is that? You know, I'm getting quite boring because in the programme notes every single week, I just can't do anything other than just praise the fans because they just certainly lift the lads. It's unbelievable, the atmosphere is unbelievable. Um, and the lads react to it and respond to it. Uh, and they enjoy interacting with uh, with the fans as well. And I'm sure that's reciprocated the other way because they've all enjoyed the celebration tonight afterwards again. And they can see we've worked hard for it and, and had to do some, you know, the other side of football. We played really well on Saturday, but today we've had to battle and scrap and, and win a game by doing that. So, yeah, brilliant. Can't can't fault the fans at all. You say the team have worked hard. You've worked hard enough to go and get warm, I think. <laughs> go and get what, sorry? Go and get warm, Martin. Yeah, my <laughs> <laughs> batteries run out as well on my vest. Oh, no. Right, <laughs> no thank problem, you, Matt. Matt.